It was coming down a little bit on my way in, so I had to take it slow and I just stepped outside again and it's coming down even more. So can we expect snow all throughout the day today? Yeah, Joshua, it is looking like we'll still hold on to scattered snow showers this morning, this afternoon, into the evening. They'll start to become a little bit weaker. We won't see it as widespread, but they are going to be scattered today. So we will see on and off snow showers for some of the area. We did make our mark on that national current snow depth map. Not everyone did see the snowfall. Our eastern slopes did lack just a little bit, but this was an upslope snow event. So that mainly means that it mainly hung onto the western half of the viewing area. So throughout today, we can expect some blowing snowfall. So poor visibility is possible during the travel really all day today. That's possible. Winds will still be pretty strong. Icy roadways, that's still possible all day today too, because really most of the area will have a hard time warming up or up freezing for those high temperatures. Wind gusts will continue to be about 20 to 30 miles per hour today, tonight, and even in the tomorrow morning, we'll still hold on to some stronger winds. But throughout the day on Wednesday, winds will try to calm on down as high pressure will start to build in. So here's a look right now at radar, just showing these scattered snow showers for us this morning. We still have a little bit more moisture off to our west, so that's going to continue to funnel in today. We're having this counterclockwise flow. That will allow these snow showers to still pull into our area. We're under a winter weather advisory for southern and eastern Pocahontas County, for eastern Greenbrier County, Fayette, Raleigh, Wyoming, McDowell, Buchanan, Tazewell, Mercer, and Summers counties, all until 7 p.m. this evening. We do have a winter storm warning for northern and western Pocahontas County, as well as western Greenbrier County now. This warning will continue until 7 p.m. this evening, too. So we're still expecting some snowfall, and we're still going to hold on to cold temperatures today. Right now, here's a look at our temperatures sitting into the 20s and the lower 30s. Our wind chill values, most of us are feeling like the teens and the lower 20s out there. Berks Garden right now feels like 8 degrees. So it is going to be chilly today. We're really not going to warm up. So wind chill values, we can still expect them to read into the teens and the lower 20s throughout all day today. We're going to remain windy and cold as well. We do notice, though, that our precipitation chances do decrease throughout the day. So we'll start to notice showers become a little bit lighter and even more scattered in nature. So the best time to see snowfall will actually be this morning. By the afternoon, we'll start to see that snow showers will mainly hug, mainly up to the northern half of the viewing area. And then eventually, snow will taper off overnight tonight. So I think most of us will be dry by this evening. A few snow flurries are possible overnight and into early Wednesday morning. But we will have a dry day overall for us tomorrow. That sunshine will come back. That will help warm us up a little bit. Temperatures tomorrow will read into the upper 30s and the 40s. So we do eventually warm things back up. This is looking at the GFS model. So this is not an accurate forecast completely to say. But it's just showing we will still see some more accumulating snowfall today. I think anywhere we could see roughly around one to four inches more, especially on those western half, just depending on that location. This is the totality of the snow forecast of this event. So, of course, eastern slopes only a trace one inch. Then we have that one to two inch ballpark right around that ridge line, one to three inches as you head off more to the southwest, including western Fayette County, two to four inches as you head up to north of that I-64 corridor, and four to seven inches in western Greenbrier and western Pocahontas County, where that winter storm warning is active. So, we're going to continue to hold on to some scattered snow showers throughout today, drying things out overnight tonight. We should see a drier day in store tomorrow with mostly sunny skies. 